in the last episode of the Wrestling Club, Kirim would have managed to make the sign of Jefferson Lama for seven million from Bournemouth, and also Facundo Gares for five million from Aston Villa, and we absolutely got demolished by um, Lanos. We conceded five goals for the first time in this FIFA, and Chankalai pick up play at the episode for the second time. Hi guys, welcome to episode three of the Wrestling Club, Kirim. In today's episode, we will go through the month of October. And November, we do have uh, easy games to say the least, uh, especially in the month of November. We have um, this club and we have Huracan and San Lorenzo. San Lorenzo will be a game I'll definitely play. And the other two games, I'm not sure. I'll just see uh, based on the team that's higher up in the league. I've also uh, forgot to show you guys what I have um, released all the other Youth Academy players because they were not really high rated, um, except for this Adan uh, Costa, the Mexican goalkeeper, looks decent. Um, I don't know if I would use him, but uh, you never know. I might, um, might uh, bring him on just in case our goalkeeper injured. We got our first game at the episode is going to be against Gymnasia, who currently sit in the 20th place. So it will be a game I will be quick simming and hoping uh, for three points. And we just do that. Valencia scoring and Cordona again scoring. So good to see uh, Valencia back on the scoring. We got our first played game at the episode is going to be against Cologne, who's sitting in uh, eighth place. So uh, we did sign Facundo Gares from them, so they do have a pretty nice team. So I'm expecting a tough game here against them at home. As they started showing with the corner, Baradi here, I think, is he related to the Baradi? I'm not sure, but they get a nice head in. That was really close, but a great save from our goalkeeper, uh, Adias. They're putting out four corners. We almost played a beautiful ball here, but they defended really deep there. And yeah, we should have put that at least on target, but yeah, good for them. They defended real well. There was nothing much in this game other than those um, shots they took, but I think it was called for offside as we had a really good chance here in the 74th minute. Um, unfortunately, the cross was too low to the goalkeeper, so he just put a hand there as we have a good chance here. Uh, Valencia beating this man, but he doesn't have any money. He tried cutting in, but again, it's defended really easily there. And there was nothing yet. This was the most cagey game I played. Not really many chances, and the chances we had, we didn't take him in. In the final minute, this should have been at least on target, but he goes out for a corner. As that's how the game's going to end. We only pick up a point against Cologne. Our next game of the episode is going to be against Patronato, who's sitting dead last. So I'm expecting easy three points here on the road, and it's not as easy as I thought, but. We still do pick up three points. Diego Valencia scoring the goal in the 38th minute. The next game I chose to play is going to be against Club Athletic uh, Tucuman, uh, who sit at the bottom of the league. So I was expecting an easy win, but um, I was actually wrong. That so we had a good chance at the beginning. Nice cross to find Chankalai, who is in a hot form, but uh, it was a great save from that goalkeeper. And to be honest, Chankalai, I'm not Chankalai. The Club Athletic Tucuman played their best there. Um, I wasn't expecting much from them, to be honest. They were the underdog in this game, and they really played that role really nicely as they get good shots on target. Again, uh, Sarias Arias safe in there as we have another good chance here. Nice turn from Rojas there, shooting with his right foot. Um, I think it was Miranda there, but it goes way wide of the post as we get another good chance. Uh, Diego Valencia with a nice header this time. Again, um, just not enough direction to, and it goes into the hand of the goalkeeper as they score their first goal of the game here. It was bound to happen. I could just feel the defenders. I don't know if the new patch, just my defenders just seemed like the idiots. They don't move unless I'm moving them, which is kind of sucks, but it is what it is. You have to deal with it as they have some more chance there. Arias saving us in there. I think it should have been at least 3 0 in this game if it wasn't for Arias. And that miss at right before halftime from Diego Valencia. Not something you expect from him, especially that should have been in the back of the net as Club Tucuman again started strong in the second half, getting a nice shot there. And in the 67th minute, um, somehow my defender couldn't block it there, but um, it was a man sent in the post by himself. No one was marking him, and he makes a tune in the 78th minute to make it uh, to all here as we take a good shot there and the goalkeeper coming in clutch there saving them but we didn't deserve anything from this game and just shows you how we defended throughout the whole series not um, not the whole series but the last two episodes um, I looked it up and I, I thought it was me just with defending but it's um, everybody else our uh, defending has been really bad in this FIFA but they take a shot there at the end and it just goes wide and we do pick up a massive L to a club we should have won easily this game against Cordoba who sit in second to dead last so we haven't had the best of episodes so far and we do pick up a 4-2 win Cordoba scoring and Chankali again is keeping his uh, great display scoring a breeze there here we go final game at the episode is going to be against Hurukana home 
and we just need to bounce back from that defeat there. We had a good game, uh, our last game, but we started strong here. Diego Valencia scoring the first goal of the game here. He really needed that just to boost his confidence as he hasn't really been uh, great, but he will score two absolute bang here and talk about this goal here. This could challenge Matias Rojas' first goal of the season, but who knows, you guys have to find out. Two absolute beautiful goals we have scored in like what three episodes as they get another good chance here taking shots there but it will not trouble our goalkeeper there as we have another good chance this should have been in the back of the net as well but um diego valencia um just couldn't control the build that well as they come here scored another goal here but um uh for a second i thought um that was offside but it wasn't but they do make it they do make it 2-1 here in the 37th minute and we do have another good chance at chunk like cutting in um and he takes the shot and the goalkeeper just put in a hand there just getting um, outside of the post as they have the chance here right before halftime I'm on looking for someone he back heals it and then he passed his teammate put in a dangerous position and the goalkeeper comes out and we unfortunately get on top of that position as they have another good chance in front of our chance and they make it 2-2 here in the 58th minute at this point I was just going through my mind I was like yep it is it's the same the same thing every time we score a goal we can defend it's the same old thing but Diego Valencia unfortunately he makes it 3-2 in the 61 minute and he will get his first hat-trick and I think first hat-trick at the um, series as we tried going for long balls but I made him work out but yeah I just need to figure out some tactics again I'm really messing and tweaking the tactics until I find something that's good for me but we do pick up uh, three points here against uh, Hurukan to be against San Lorenzo at the bottom of the league so we're looking to end the episode on a high picking up three points should be good and we absolutely demolished them 4-0 beating them and Chan Klai there with another performance ah what is in the water with this guy he just keeps scoring for fun and Cordona there scoring good to see it's a tough one Chan Klai had a great episode so is Diego Valencia so I don't I don't really know so I'm gonna give it to Valencia cuz uh um, I feel like the hat trick was good. Um, so he picks up his first play at the episode. And if you made it this far into the episode, make sure you leave a like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys next episode. Peace.